Alright, I'm watching this video of Street Fighter Cross Tekken. Producer Tomaaki Yayo Yayo. Producer of Street Fighter Cross Tekken on the Vita. Talks about battling over 3G and how disappointed by the hacking of the games on this DLC characters. Well, Tomoaki, I have new flash for you. That's your fault, dude. It's uh, your fault, man. It's your fault. It's your fault. And he was making excuses in this video. And people in the comments in this video are cheering him up. You know what I'm saying? Like, you, man, this game, don't get me wrong. I like Street Fighter Cross Tekken. It's a fun game. I think I like I like it better than Street Fighter 4. But it all comes down to there's some stuff I don't like about it. The time overs, the damage scaling, which is ridiculous after six hits of combo. And freaking, uh, yeah, the freaking gym system. That And this, the DLC characters kind of like drained all of my hype of this game completely. Like, I don't even play it that much anymore. And there's a lot of people in the fighting game community don't really play it that much. They just, you know, they just play it casually. Like, I only see the three pe three people in tournaments playing this game. That's Chris G, Dominion, and freaking uh, Arturo. And Long Island Joe. So, that being said, man, check out the video. Link in the description, man. This, like, <laughs> seriously, man. Like, I'm, I'm getting ready to, like give this to my friend uh this game cuz he wants it but um i probably just play it from time to time over his house but uh, i have no since, since Tekken Tag 2 is almost near not almost near but we got some months left and Persona 4 and Virtual Fighter 5 Final Showdown Dead Alive 5 i'm not going to be playing this game that much anyway the Skull Girls is getting my attention too and you know KOF 13 but this game should not be taken competitively at all. But people don't take it competitively anyways. But any game can be taken competitively. You just gotta put your mind into it, I guess. But um it's, it's it reminds me of Street Fighter Four properties that there was some BS in Street Fighter Four in general. And that's not a good sign for me. But Capcom and Tomoaki, you messed up, dude.